Father, I think you should see this. Read it. Yes, sir. To Njord, we offer back the seas back. Ah, yes. It was believed that Njord calmed the winds and seas. An Alfheim light crystal. Wonder what it's for.
Well, here's the base for the crystal we saw, but how do we get it down? How are we getting down there? I have a plan. You do? Do not act so surprised. Well, no offense, brother. 
But I don't even think Thor with Mjolnir in hand could get through that much ice. Then Thor is a fool. This should be entertaining. Boy. Right. Wow, that was uh, something, that uh, fight. Here, catch. Well, that was a waste of a perfectly good hour. How were you not seen? There is nowhere here to hide. Oh, that. It's a little trick my people can pull. A special way of not being seen. 
You can be invisible? More like I can step into the realm between realms. And your mind doesn't understand what it's seeing, so it sees nothing at all. That's how we avoid ever having to actually use the weapons we craft. It, uh, it doesn't seem to work on dragons, though. <laughs> your brother wanted to know if you're getting enough to eat. I guess I could tell him you are. Brock was asking about me? Was there meat on his breath? <laughs> You let him touch this again. Come on, then. So that's how Brock was in the temple right after the water drop. He stepped between realms. Okay, now, shush. I need complete silence for this. There you go. To work we go. Feeling less cluttered already. Oh. Hmm, what shall it be?
looks amazing. Good, good. Also, remember to breathe. Good help. I'm sure that'll come in handy. And what can I do for you? Something else for you, then? And for the youngster? Back to you. What a surprise. Oh, we can't forget you. What did we miss?
And for you? What more do you need? Was there something else? So what brings you around, friends? Okay, come back when you need something, I guess. So, Lennon, a fine line can you guess it? Knowing you, you know. it doesn't involve standing around here. Correct. But how do we move forward?
Boy, Farmer really liked jewelry, didn't he? He even braided his beard with it. I happen to think he looks dashing. You know, a snow covered corpse. Follow me, Atreus. On my way! Just make sure you watch each other's backs in the storeroom. Wouldn't want to lose my loyal customers. So, this plan of yours? Can you guess it? Knowing you, it doesn't involve standing around here. Correct. But how do we move forward?
My shop's right here! Heading into that building? Yes. You think there's something inside that'll help us break the ice and get to the chisel tip? No. Mm. I'll keep thinking. Focus up, boy! done.
I have completed the store. Come here. You knew this place? Before? You post to knock the down the PS diplomatic mission once, trying to you Asgard and Vanaheim. That war. So many lives lost. Why I didn't know was Thor had already gone on a killing spree of giants. What did the giants have to do with the war between the gods? Nothing at all, lad. That's the tragedy of it. They took no side in that madness. But Odin's paranoia is surpassed only by Thor's lust for blood. There we go. Holy crap. Thank you. I did not know I was supposed to knock that out of his hand. Another crystal. Just give the word. Huh. What now?
A stealthy plan it is not. Now we must free the other strap. We do? Going up, and what we need is all the way down there. Think. Well, the chisel tip is under thick layers of ice, so melting it won't work. Correct. And there weren't any shattered crystals nearby for me to shoot, so that's not an option. Correct. I just leave smashing the ice. We need something ridiculously heavy to. Oh, I get it now. Bird. How are we going to turn the hammer so it lands near the chisel tip? Not possible. We cut it free, write it down, and figure out what comes next after. So your plan involves a whole bunch of luck then? You are welcome to suggest a different one. Tight. Uh, the plan seems ill advised. little ways. Oh no! The floor's collapsed! There's a sand bowl, but how do we get to it? We cannot.
What does it say? When time itself is disarrayed, the forward path is retrograde. Retrograde? It's backwards? Those symbols. The seasons? Yeah, but the order's all jumbled. Shouldn't it be winter, spring, summer, autumn? Why start with winter? It's from a song Mother used to sing. Don't I know that one? Winter that... Quiet head. Doesn't like music either. Got it. There. Bar. House. Vetcher. Suma. No, -uh. that wasn't right. Try that. Vet. House. Bauer. Sumar. Still nothing. Boy, the order from the song again. Winter, spring, summer, on. Try that. Var. Sumar. House. It didn't work, but I know that's the order in the song Mom said.
Atreus, that word. Thola. It means endure. Try it. Thola. Well done, lad. Write it again. Keep writing. Thola. 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 Head. How is this possible? My guess? Temporal magic. Dangerous stuff the High Vanir gods used to play around with. The ability to freeze time, though. Happened to be a favorite of Njord himself, in fact. Used to? Why did they stop? Well, turns out stopping time keeps the sun and moon from streaking across the sky. Unfortunately, it does not stop the wolves that chase them, always looking to sink their teeth in. After that, they decided it was best to leave time alone. I can't get to the bull! before the floor collapses.
nothing left to go with that for nothing. Thanks. The boy. Just having a little fun, you big grump. There it is. How are we going to get it free? A push. But trust me. <sighs> Ready. Dig in and push with everything. Yes, sir. credit. He has a talent for destroying things. Remember that head. Never leaves my mind. There's something over there. <laughs>
the kid, right? Father. Not now. Those were the guys we saw with Balder. His nephews? Aye. Magni and Modi. The sons of Thor. Mother always said the Aesir were the worst of gods. And Thor was the worst of the Aesir. Guess he's a terrible father, too. They are no longer children. They have no excuse. Will Sindri be okay? They'll never even see him. the great dining hall. Envy of all Midgard. Funny. I remember there being a massive candelabrum. Really livened up the place. There. Ah, yes. Can't help but break things, can you? Yeah. Memory serves. The Jarl's throne was just on the other side of that wall of ice.
can see a path out, but there's no way to reach it. Over to the right, brother!
something ahead. See, lad, he's fine. Thought it best to vanish when Thor's idiot sons showed up. Hey, Sindri, could you take a look at this? Honestly? I don't have much else going on right now. Oh. The travelers. Oh, disgusting. Mm. Smelly, covered in God knows how many little beasties, but gorgeous armor. Let's see if I can't make something more sanitary. Yes? Found anything good in Fafnir's storeroom? Like, maybe, a whetstone? Those men, what do you know of them? First, they're not men, they're gods. Well, demigods. Anyway, let's see. Thor's their dad, different moms, sordid story that one, Baldur's their uncle, Odin, dear old grandpa, oh, and a sister named... Weapons. How do they fight? Oh, of course. Magni's strong. Really strong. Carries a huge sword hardened by cyclonic thunder. And Modi? Ugh. I'd sooner lick a rat than shake that dung heap's hand. His mason shields are just a cheap knockoff of my elegant work on their dad's hammer. Best to follow my lead and avoid, but <laughs> who am I talking to? Ready and ready. If I say so myself. I'm sure that'll come in handy. Now, there is something else to tell you. Why? Is that a piece of my braided mistletoe arrow adorning your quiver strap? Oh, a little memento of your good pal, Sindri? I'm so... terribly touched. Be careful where you're going. There's nobody nice out here anymore since all the people... I mean, I hate to generalize, but, um... Mostly, they just try to kill you. Good tip.
Will you focus on your damn job and take that shit? I mean it! He went to war with Uncle and walked away. Maybe. Uncle had three straight years. As long as Father believes him, so do we. So you will stop talking. Focus and help me. Hurry, brother. We may get a piece of the chisel and be gone before they even notice. Freak's got a bow. What are we gonna do? <laughs> Small one short. Don't tell me. Hunt us. What does Odin want? Go! 
focus. Yeah! <laughs> 
get you. You have no idea. You son of a bitch! No, no. Ah! The boy's sick, he needs Freya. No! Steady. I'll be all right. There you go, lad. <clears throat> I'm fine, see? We should keep an eye on him. Enough. Should do. With that, we can carve the travel rune to Jotunheim. Get you where you need to go. Oh, incidentally, all those magically sealed doors we've seen can now be unlocked. Like that one round the corner. You can get through that door there now that you've got the chisel. You killed Magni. That he did. He was a god. But you killed him. Minor Aesir, perhaps. But I. And his father is Thor. Not minor. Not minor at all, him. This will not go over well in Asgard. I defended us. Nothing more. I fear no judgment. Judgment, no. But if vengeance is any concern. Since when can you kill a god? <coughs>
found anything good in Fafnir's storeroom, like maybe Wait, a whetstone? Wait, we were here before. But which way back? I don't think the lad's doing too well. I'm fine. <coughs> if so, then keep up. to life. That is interesting. It's known the Aesir find their own way to Valhalla. No Valkyrie escort, no processing at the gates of Helheim. That may be significant.
Look, we're back near the giant's hand. What? What is this place? Fisherman would bring the day's catch into this port and use that contraption to send some of it directly to the Jarl's main kitchen. The rest were sorted and sold. There is an exit under the thumb. Find a way across. There is an opening. I can get it. There's a path to the exit on the other side. up here. Back under his palm. We're almost there. Everything we just did. Climbed around a dead giant. Wrote a giant falling hammer. Fought some bad gods. What do you think Mother would say? Bet you have come a long way. Thanks.
What now then? Maybe Freya ought to have a look at the boy. No, I feel better now. I just needed to catch my breath. Where do we go next? Well, now that we've got the giant's chisel, we need to learn the travel room to Jotunheim, so we can carve it into that special gateway atop the peak, and open realm travel to the land of the giants. You don't know it? Alas, no. But the serpent did mention that the giants had entrusted that secret to Tyr. Isn't Tyr dead? Aye. But his hidden boat is very much in reach. The doors are beneath his temple, submerged in the lake of generations until our snake friend shifted his weight. There we shall find the fabled Black Rune of Jotunheim. We could also explore some more. We got that chisel now, and that vault isn't going in. Seems a shame to waste the boat. We shall see, boy. I can't believe Odin and Freya were ever married. Love and hate are more closely intertwined than you might imagine. For instance, Odin hates the giants and they him. But Thor's own mother was the giantess Björgun, one of Odin's great loves. So Thor's half god and half giant? Where? Once Björgun was gone, lonely ages passed. And as war with the Vanir raged, I could see what he really wanted in his bluster. And after no small amount of convincing, Freya agreed. For a while there, he really turned on the charm. He seemed happy. He seemed interested in making her happy. He granted her so many wishes, I can scarcely recall them all. The peace held, and I truly believed all had worked out better than I could have planned. But Odin's true face showed itself again in the end. Oh, he won Freya's trust, and she taught him some of her Vanir magic, another choice she would live to bitterly regret. Sadly, despite his wise counselor's best efforts to persuade him that peace was the only true path to stave off Ragnarok, Odin never let go of his obsession with Jotunheim. And we'll pick this up later. These bones pulse with magic. It must be Golvi. Could we... Can we just hold on to it? Maybe we'll find the rest of them. This spirit lies to you, boy. How would you know? I have known many spirits. They are all liars. God knows different. No. No, very little. Hellwalker! <laughs> <laughs> Prepare yourself!
Focus up, boy. Be 
ready. Slow! 
enemies ahead. Ready. Oh! <laughs> 
remember you? I don't know, lad. A lot's changed since we last crossed paths. I had legs. Did you see something out there? That tower? I see no tower. Maybe I'm seeing things. So Odin and Freya could have been happy. But he only wanted her magic? Aye. The taste of Vanir magic led him to new forms of experimentation and new levels of depravity. This is where the tower to Jotunheim should be. Feels strange somehow. No doubt some arcane magics were involved. I would be not at all surprised to learn you are sensitive to that. on that magical law. Setting foot in Tears Vault. Another one of these. Father, over the It's Tear, but the middle panel is missing. Wait, I thought Tear was a god, not a giant. Ah, 
but he was loved by everyone, including the giants. Other than me, he was the only one they gifted with their special sight. Hey, I wonder if the giants left a triptych about me somewhere, too. Go ahead. Actually, come look. Let me show you how to read this. That is not necessary. You've taught me so much. Let me teach you something. What if you need to use one and I'm not there? This will be fun. Atreus. Come on. You already speak it. Learning to read won't be that hard. I know how to read, boy. Just not this tongue. You're halfway there already, then. Okay. So the runes represent a lot of different things. Some gods. Some animals. Wait. Some... Oh, am I going too fast? Sorry, Not I'll... that. Do you smell something? Yeah, I do. It smells like... Rain? <laughs> You ruined everything! I am that fucking hammer! But now, everyone's gonna think I only got it. Cause Magni's gone! It'll be a joke! But if I kill you, no one's gonna laugh at me! Oh, are you dumb? That your father's doing? Or did you get it from your mum? She's stupid and ugly. Shut up! You don't know anything about my mother. Oh, it's true. But I'm gonna get to know you really well. You're gonna be my new brother. Right after I finish killing your father! Oh. Whoops! I think I broke him! <laughs> no! Stay back! The boy. Atreus. You have to get into Freya quickly. There's no other way. Take the boat. Freya's isn't far. Odin's eye is on you, brother. Especially now that you've taken to killing his kin. Getting his forest is a blind spot for him. This is our smartest move. And if anyone can heal him, it's her. What is happening to him? I've seen it in mortals that some conflict of the mind expresses itself as an ailment of the body. Never in my god. I think 
God believing himself mortal. I can only imagine. We're almost there. Somebody just called the serpent. He is shaking. It's serious. We must hurry. Freya! Open the door! We need your help! Woman, do you hear me? It is urgent! I'm still a god! Go away! The boy has fallen ill! Freya! Inside. This is no ordinary illness. The boy's true nature, your true nature, fights within him. I did this to him. Will you help me? Of course. There is a rare ingredient found only in Helheim. The keeper that protects the Bridge of the Damned. I need its heart. Hell. The Realm of the Dead. Do you know it? Not this one. It is a land of unyielding gold. Fires cannot burn there, and no magic in all the Nine Realms can create a blaze. As for the dead, your Frost Axe will be useless. You'll need to find something else. Then I must return home. Dig up a past I swore would stay buried. Who you were before doesn't matter. This boy is not your past, he is your son. And he needs his father. This rune opens the bridge to Helheim. When you are there, do not, under any circumstances, cross the Bridge of the Damned. There is no road back. Understand? Boy. Hey, Malay. You must hurry. Through my garden, there's a path leading to my boat. Take it. Return home. Dig up your past. Do whatever you need to do. Just bring me back the Bridge Keeper's heart. And your son may survive. Last we spoke, I was... No. You were right to distrust the word of a god. No need to explain. Not to me, not for that. I will keep him safe. That's a mother's promise. Helheim of all places. You all right, brother? I will do what I must. Leave me be. 
As you wish. Subscribe to me, please. Hi, 
danger! <laughs> There's nowhere you can hide, Spartan. Put as much distance between you and the truth as you want. It changes nothing. Pretend to be everything you are not. Teacher. Husband. Father. But there is one unavoidable truth you will never escape. <laughs> You cannot change. You will always be a monster. I know. But I am your monster no longer. Let's see what those blades can do. Yeah! <laughs> 
served quite well in Helheim. Now, I believe I see a door to the realm between realms over there, in your own front yard, no less. Take the shortcut back to the realm travel temple, then on to Helheim, yeah? Well, I'm pretty sure you weren't talking to me back there. Anything you'd like to get off your chest, brother? I can assure you I'm unsurpassed in keeping confidences. Well, you know where to find me. And for the record, I'd already guessed you were Greek. Athena, dead giveaway. Of foreign magic. Sweet Nana's nethers. What are those? I've never seen the like. That's got to be a family heirloom. No. Nor will it ever be. Son, my brother and me created me own heir for the big idiot. I know from quality. And them, them special. Hey, where's the little turd? He has fallen ill. No. What happened? Aesir? No. The fault is mine. And my responsibility to make it right. Well... We all gotta take responsibility sometime. Huh? Say, what can I do to help him? I can do things. And when I should tag along? No. Your work here is enough. All right. So where are you off to in such a hurry? The realm of the dead. Helheim? Shit, this is serious. I'll be keeping my eye on you. Don't worry, kids are tough. When I was his age, I cut my own head clean off. And I'm none the worse for wear.
Now that Freya's given you the travel room to Helheim, it should be unlocked on the table. Watching your back. Say hi to the pimple flap for me when he's better.
Let me take this moment to tell you that what you are about to do is absolutely insane. Not even Odin can survive this cold. So, I hope those blades work. Is this the bridge Freya spoke of? No, we're still on the realm travel bridge. We're after the Bridge of the Damned. The dead use it to cross into their permanent home, the city of Helheim. The bridge keeper who minds admission, he's the one we want. Just follow this bridge. Should lead us straight to him. You know, I'd really hope never to see this place again. Use the fire of your blades to burn away that Hell's Bramble blocking the path. Many reasons we went back for those blades.
the newly dead should be here. There's too many. The gate must be closed, and if the gate's closed, then it's true. Hell is full up. Without the Valkyrie to sort and cull them, hell is over well. Locked. Now what? Hi. When we killed the Reavers near my home, they came here. How did they return so quickly? Time doesn't move the same between all realms, especially where the spirit world is concerned. Like the Light of Alfheim? The opposite, in fact. The Lake of Souls feels faster than Alfheim time, but Hell is much slower than Midgard. Sorry, I'm sure that's confusing. If we will be back to my son all the sooner, that is good. Ah, aren't you a quick study?
Is it within hell? Oh, no, no. Valhalla is part of Asgard. Only the worthy dead go there, the warriors who die in glorious combat. Hell is for those who die in dishonor. Criminals. Aye. And those dead of disease, mishap, age. It is dishonorable to grow old. Well, never too late to go out fighting, I suppose. <laughs> Find there could lead us out if we could reach it. Killing the bridge keeper helped the dead lead Midgard. I don't expect it will, though I don't suppose it will make things any worse either. It'll be one less obstacle for the living to reach the inner sanctum of Helheim. But who'd be mad enough to go there?
The Bridge of the Damned. And there's the Keeper, making sure the dead are really dead. What is that he holds? That totem contains a powerful source of magical energy, the very power of Helheim itself. But what you want is his heart. Just take it and we can leave. How? Start some trouble. You can do that, right? <laughs>